Excuse me. So, hi, it's Richard from My Analog Life. And, yeah, it's been a while. <laughs> so, today I'm going to do a couple of videos. Um, one, I'm just going to do a quick overview of where I've been, what I've been up to, and um, what I've got coming up. Uh, and then the second video, I'm going to do a um, bit of an artist insight series on myself, just to give, well, a record of where I'm at. And if anyone watches these things, then a little bit of insight about me. So. Let's get into the where and why and when, <laughs> I guess. Um, so first of all, I need to kind of like say um, the audio is pretty pants. I'm using a cheap eBay microphone. The studio is very echoey. Um, there's no acoustics. So that's something we need to address. Get some uh, acoustic panels. But where have I been? So, uh, anyone who knows me knows that I've had a few personal issues, um, but I've still been around. I've been shooting, uh, using the studio, and yeah, just generally just keeping my head down. The reason for that is, and again, I'll touch on this in the Artist Insight, but social media, keyboard warriors, basically people that have to give their two penneth worth have really been plaguing me and annoying me, <laughs> ironically. So I've, at the moment, I'm in my sixth, seventh day, sorry, of a 30 day challenge to delete social media. So I've deleted all social media off my phone. I limit my time on the computer at home. I don't go on Facebook. I don't go on Instagram. Um, I just generally use um, YouTube. Uh, I use that for a couple of things. One, I stream music in the gym. Um, and then the second one is I uh, learn and watch videos. So I've been a, away from the photography scene as such on socials but I have been shooting, so I've been doing my own stuff in the studio. I have been trying to make videos for quite a while and it's not been easy. I'll include a clip of me just doing this bit where my camera just fell off where I had it sat on something. It wasn't actually a tripod, it was um, sat on a stool and yeah, it fell off. <laughs> so. I've had issues like this, I've tried to do a video on this new light I've got which is the um, Godox uh, SL60W I believe um, and yeah I didn't bring a microphone or a lav mic and trying to film on the camera the internal mic was awful, there was people running around in the building and as all you can hear is noises and screaming and so it's not just that, I've had other days where I've had model shoots and the camera's battery ran out, I've had model shoots and the um, memory card was full, I've tried to do shoots in here of saying about my light setups and things have kind of like got to the point where issues have happened and so yeah, I've, I've kind of like, that just kind of killed it so I thought give it a while get of a break just you know just concentrate on your photography and yeah so um it was a bit of a pain in the butt because i did actually say some good words in the video i did about this light um but obviously the audio is shocking so uh, you can hear the um the lens hunting so this is the difference between killing the ambient light and uh, the last shot was with the room lights on as well so uh, it is a little bit darker I've had to go up with the light to 100% brightness and we've come down on the aperture on the lens so uh, yeah it's quite good I think with a couple of these it could work quite well as well as the ambient noise um, and also the echo of the studio so um, yeah I'm kind of just 
doing it again. <laughs> um, but what I'll do is I'll show you bits and pieces of what I've been doing. My model's turned up for the day and it's the lovely CJ. <laughs> so we're just about to set upon for the first uh, set. <laughs> yeah, I can't speak now. Um, yeah, so we're going to set up, do some portraits and some just have a fun for a bit. Um, we'll show you a bit of behind the scenes and we'll just get on with it. <laughs> So I've had quite a few different shoots. I tend to work with a couple of models quite often because I enjoy their company, I enjoy the way they work, um, and the relationship that we've got is very good. The working relationship means, you know, I can say to do something and they're willing to give it a try, or they come up with an idea and we'll try it. Um, so I'm in the studio today waiting for Model L, who's uh, this lady here on this poster. <laughs> So at the moment I'm just uh, mopping the floor, cleaning up, which is something I like to do before the model turns up, just so it's nice and clean and fresh. Um, she comes in and it's not dirty. Uh, so yeah, we're just gonna set up. I'm gonna actually set the lights up if I have time, um, just so we can get going, because today's shoot, we've only got a few hours. So yeah, let's crack on.
So we've done, a, I think we're on the third look. Um, we're just about to change into the fourth look. Uh, the model's got to go in about an hour, so we're going to be quite quick. Um, I'll probably show you some of the behind the scenes, but this is going to be kind of a, a, a multi-part video um, showing what I'm up to, um, a bit about the studio space. Uh, I'll talk again after I've done the shoot um, about what I'm doing with the space, where I'm at, um, things like the gallery we've been putting on, uh, and also I want to talk about a um, LED light that I've just bought, which um, I did for a uh, life drawing class that I'm putting on. So uh, yeah, well, I'll just continue with the shoot. The model's just gone to uh, the bathroom. Um, and then once we've finished the shoot, I'll then talk to you about the light, about the studio, um, and about, where I've been and kind of like how I've been finding it quite difficult to make videos just recently. So uh, yeah, carry on with the shoot and I'll see you in a bit. So it's been absolutely fantastic. So, you know, um, that's been brilliant. And anyone who, again, who knows me, who follows me, will see on Instagram, I've been posting these images. So it's not like I've just gone off the grid, um, but just on YouTube. So one thing I did want to say is if there is something that people are interested in, like now we've got the setup, we have the printer, um, buying lights like this, and also um, if in, people are interested in the way that I shoot people, so whether it's portraits, model portfolio, fashion shoot, um, if people are interested in that and the way that I light it, then drop me a comment and I'll make some videos on that. Otherwise, I have other things that I'm in the pipeline working on. Um, a friend of mine's never shot film, so I'm going to get him to shoot and develop a role of film, which he's excited about. Um, and then also in the studio, we have other things going on, like we have a network night coming up. Um, this will be our fourth. And then we have other things like we're doing a life drawing class and we also do a gallery of work. Um, <coughs> So I've already shot another episode with one of the girls or the photographers that we had for the exhibition on the network night. Um, so that is an Artist Insight series that I will be putting up. But I wanted to put up this, then the Artist Insight series. I'm going to ask myself, then I'll put Lucy's up. Just kind of a bit of a flow and a bit of explaining where I've been otherwise putting up a random video for no reason even though the channel is mainly for me it's a bit fragmented so yeah anyway enough waffle from me um, again I'm gonna put in here um, a few bits and pieces of what I've been up to uh, I went up to Scotland with my friend John over Christmas and that was fantastic um, I might cobble together a video on that so we just stopped the car set up um, to take a few pictures and uh, yeah who's the dumbass that left the uh, memory card in the car so i just had to run back but <sighs> normally i wouldn't care but <sighs> will that do yeah i think that'll do <laughs> uh, and then also some other bits and pieces like going out and about so yeah I've not really fallen off the grid I'm still around um, even though I'm trying to concentrate on me and personal growth so again I'm going to touch on that in the Artist Insight series so if you're interested watch the Artist Insight series if you want to know more about light setups and um, things then yeah just leave a comment below and uh, I'm gonna get onto that so <clears throat> this is a pretty terrible video but as usual and I believe the guys Mark Twain or some I can't remember the actual name of it but they say basically done versus perfect and to kind of get on with it and make something rather than just talk about it and think about it so yeah hopefully the productivity and videos will in, will get better <laughs> and I'll keep saying that <laughs> But yeah, so uh, we'll get on with the next one. Ciao for now.